Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's 37 box Bring Back Baseball Mixer. Random team break, 30 spots. Everyone gets a uh, random team in the MLB. No vet common ship, tons of value in this mixer. You saw the whole list of uh, boxes right here. Some of the possibilities of what we can pull out of these breaks. Big thanks to this group. We only had to do one filler, which was awesome. So thanks to everybody who bought their spots straight up. And there's all the 30 teams right there. Let's roll it, randomize it. Four and a one, five times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, and once more, right? Yep, one, fifth and final time. After five, we've got Zach down to Chris. Four and a one, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and once more, fifth and final time. After five, we got my Dodgers down to the White Sox. All right, so Zach, you got the Dodgers, Jeff with the Orioles, Kevin with the Blue Jays, Chris with the A's, Michael with the Brew Crew, Kevin with the Guardians, David with the Nats, Brian, uh, Brian P with the Astros, Brian B with the Mariners, Chris with the Twins, Brian T with the Giants, or with the Royals, Dom has the Giants, Joel with the Rays, Brian with the uh, Pirates, Michael with the Cardinals, Kevin with the Reds, Michael with the uh, Yankees, Matt with the Diamondbacks, Reed with the Angels, Martin with the Rangers, Michael with the Met, uh, Mets, Matt with the Red Sox, Harry with the Phillies, David with the Tigers, Last Bond Mojo, Joel with the Padres, Brad with the Braves, Thomas with the Marlins, Don with the Cubs, Tim with the Rockies, and Chris with the Chicago White Sox. All right, so let's sort this uh, by column B by team alphabetically. If you need to see your team again, let me know. Um, and we're not going to uh, we're not going to pause the video. We're just going to keep the video running because um, Evan's up there ripping packs for us. But trade window is open. I have all the supplies I need for this. All right, uh, Zach has uh, is putting the Dodgers out there for trade. At least he'll be entertaining offers for the Dodgers. Michael's happy with the uh, with the New York teams. There you go. That's a good draw. We'll give it another thirty seconds or so, another minute or so, maybe maybe a little bit longer, depending on how many trade offers there are out there. No, no offers for Zach. Michael's happy with his teams. Thomas maybe throwing a Marlins Dodgers offer out there. And again, just remember, just remember to keep it keep in mind. I think it's mostly there's some 16, there's some 17, there's some 2021, 20, some 19. Remember, there's also some hit parade autograph baseballs, which we'll use our uh, no checklist rules on. There's some mini helmets as well, so there could be a wide cross-section of, uh, of stuff. Remember, our no checklist rules, right? Unless like the team is literally stamped on these autographed baseballs, they'll go to the team that they're currently on if they're active, or the team they played for the longest if, um, if they're retired. 
just for those uh, just for those memorabilia type stuff. Zach, you're good on the Marlins, meaning you you were accepting the trade. Oh, not accepting. Okay. All right. Well, let's close the trade window then. No other offers being thrown out there. TWC trade window closed. Let's print, let's rip, and let's embark on this 37 box journey. Here is the printout, hot off the presses. And thank you everybody for, for getting in and for making this happen. All right, what do we got here? Box, box, box. So four boxes of Diamond Kings right here. One, two, three, and four. All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. So obviously these are inserts. These are gonna ship, right? But these are considered common, so they're not gonna ship. The RCs, of course, will ship. And Jay Cronorth, obviously, a frame that will ship. And that's an insert that will ship, so on and so forth. Only veteran commons are the ones not shipping. It's an artist proof right there, 38 out of 49. We're just gonna set these aside, just in the interest of time. We're gonna have our sorting and shipping team sleeve and top load all numbered cards. Relics and autos I'll take care of right away. And like any low numbered card, like to 10 or whatever, 10 or less. There is our first autograph, 30, uh, 97 out of 99, Garrett Crochet for the Chicago White Sox. First auto is going to go to Chris Parent in the White Sox. Evan, what is your take on the on this whole lockout? I think it's nothing but greed, and I think that they need to get to play some baseball. Even if it's 159 games, I think that it is needed in times like these crazy times. I'm healing for America. Yeah, yeah. America's pastime. We gotta bring that back. I agree. Yeah. They're making enough. Everybody's making enough. Everybody. Own owners, players, you know, like. Had record revenue. Yeah, I know, right? What about you? What do you think? I I agree with you. Cool. And they're what? And they're and they're they're like we're talking about like they're so close. ten thousand dollars here yeah. a year and a million dollars here there in the bonus pool. Stuff that just doesn't. Twelve mean. teams or fourteen teams in the playoffs, Ridiculous. like. It's really not that much. Shane McClanahan for the Tampa Bay Rays for Joel. That was the first block. Now, from what I understand, Evan, is that, remember they had that marathon session and they were there they talking to like three in the morning or something like yeah. that. Apparently, like after they woke up, Major League Baseball hit them with all these amendments in the, in the proposal like oh. super early in the morning and they were super close. And so then the players were like, well, a few guys, like yeah, they were, seriously. they were like really pissed because they felt they got kind of got, kind of got uh, broadsided by sort of right. surprised by all these like extra little things Jeez. that weren't really on the table before. So yeah, we got the report that they were close, and then it was like, right. well, no chance. Right. So I don't know. Hopefully they'll get together this week and figure it out. Look, it only cost us six games right now. <laughs> right, which is not that much. Yeah, nobody I, will miss a week. Yeah, I'm not gonna miss a week. We missed two weeks, three, no, and that, that, that starts to get, yeah. It's gotta be something for me to watch live. This right. Time. 58 out of 99, Alex Kirlov. That is for the Twins, that's gonna be for Chris Walker. AC Salvador, hello. Callie's Finest, what's going on?
Right, and, and as they should, Michael. Yeah, the, the, you know, the Bryce Harvers and Mike Trouts of the world, they're not hurting for the money, but they are fighting for, like, the 40th man on the roster, you know what I mean, who's making making minimum wage and, you know, like, or league minimum, which in the scope of things is not really a lot, especially if you can be cut the next day, you know what I mean? So... So they're just kind of looking for, looking up, looking for the future of baseball, and you know, right? You're only getting paid during the season. I know a lot of minor leaguers. The minor leaguers are especially hurting. Yeah. There's Kyle Lewis. These guys are living out of their cars. Yep. I you know. know. You know, or they're working at Amazon in the off season. If they yeah. like drop a box on their foot, yeah, they're it. not getting covered by the team. It's, it's off season. Yeah. Then you're done. Then you're not making the team next yeah. year. Brian B. with the Mariners gets the Kyle Lewis dual relic. So hopefully they get their act together, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, we'd be talking baseball right now. Yeah. Spring training, talking about pitchers exactly. and catchers. I'd be like, hey, who wants to go take trips to Arizona? Yeah. <laughs> I, was, I was planning on a trip, too. Oh, man. Your cousin played minor oh, league ball. Oh, yeah, it's it's oh, real tough. It's on the table right there. Okay. It is yeah. it is real tough. I mean, unless you're like a first round pick with multi million dollar bonuses, you know, think about how many rounds there are in baseball. There's a lot of these like fifth, six round guys that like if your parents aren't rich or whatever. Dude, fifth, six round. It used to go what fifty six yeah. rounds. Yeah. Can you imagine like like if 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 the if if the teams don't give you um, housing, right? No. Like. You're, you're trying to find a three-month lease? What landlord's going to give you three months at a time knowing that you're going to be gone? But You just got to hope that that city is yeah. <laughs> around the team. Out of 25, Joe Cronin, Boston Red Sox, Matt. I was playing on Arizona, Michael, but but if, if there's an open invitation to hang out at your place in Tampa. <laughs> what minor league teams do you have? Uh, what, what, what clubs are near your area in Tampa Bay? I guess from Tampa you can probably go anywhere, right? Within a couple hour drive? Probably hit up a lot of teams. But what's in your immediate area? There's an artist proof Tucker Davidson to 49. Got David Peterson for the Mets to 99. That's Michael P's first autograph. It's like 38 out of 99. I really like the artwork in this Diamond Kings. There's Tyler Stevenson. Dual relic and auto. 8 out of 25. It's a bit of the, the red seal right there. That's really cool. That's going to go to uh, Kevin with the red legs. Evan, do you know why they call him the red legs back then? Uh, why? For a moment. Because of communism. So when, when Joseph McCarthy was uh, was asking everybody if they were communists or not, the Cincinnati Reds in like the 50s did not want to be associated with the Red Scare of the co oh, Russian communists. Interesting. So they nicknamed themselves the Red Legs for a little bit just so, so hey, it's about our legs, not about communism. Fun fact of the day. Fun fact, uh, fun fact of the day. Got Mel Ott for the New York Baseball Giants. And there's Pete Rose, 56 out of 99, speaking of the Reds. There's Braylon Marquez, dual relic for the Cubbies. Don with the North Siders. Got Alex Bregman. All those frames ship, of course. Lakers make the playoffs? Oh, I mean, maybe they, they sneak in. But they've got a really tough schedule ahead of them. 
Yeah. I think their next game is against like the Warriors. And, oh god. And then uh, they're, like, they're they're playing like you know top five teams after top five teams. <laughs> after top Sounds five about teams. right, right? So, yeah. All right, what do we have here? This is Topps Gallery. Yep. And it's from 2017. I don't even remember this, but let's go. There's Ty Black to 250 for the Giants. Do you know our autograph configure? Is there autographs in this? I guess we'll find out. Two autographs. Two autographs. Okay, per box. Nice. We got a 49 or 40 out of 99. Paul Goldschmidt for the Snakes. Matt Lieber with that. There's Justin Verlander, 250. Passed by a guy that I'm not. Remember Andrew Tolles? Oh yeah, of course. Um, poor guy, man. Poor guy. I think just. Is he doing better? I don't know. Oh, okay. I really don't. Like, there's the Nelson Lamet rookie auto. <laughs> he was a big prospect. Seventy-two out of nine. Yeah, Tolles was yeah. a big prospect. Him and Manny Margot. I think Tolles just had some. I, I think the rumor is, and this is not confirmed, like some mental health issues. Yeah. Just. Uh, He's probably bought that. Yeah, in that just like just the pressure got got really big for him and yeah. very similar yeah, to the uh, Delonte West situation. Right, right, right. Except I hope that <laughs> I hope that Tolls is doing better than than West. Dude, West was shooting hoops the other day. Was he really? Yeah, there was a video of it. It was crazy. Wow. He was draining. But he struggled with substance abuse, right? Well, so Delonte. You think Tolles did too? Uh, That's how he got caught originally. There's Javier Baez, green for, uh, border to 250. Poor guy. Yeah. I'm going to miss Corey Seager. He'll be in Texas this year. And we got a Paul DeYoung rookie autograph. That's not bad. Okay. Cardinals, that'll be for Michael and the Cardinals. All right, next box. That's a rookie Cody Bellinger right there. I think Cody Bellinger is going to, if we get this season going. I think so. All right. I think so. He, he was he was looking good later in the playoff. I think I think that shoulder finally started to feel better. Okay. He'll have a clean off season, right? Like he's not like getting surgery or yeah. whatever. He's gonna get a little extra time off. A little extra time off, which is good. Yep. And I think I think like I've heard like David Vasse say this, like guys who have had the similar shoulder surgery are able to play the next year, but they've just been terrible. But then the year after that, they usually bounce back to whatever they, I believe a lot whatever they were what. Yeah, right. I think Hanley Ramirez may have had a similar surgery. Oh, yeah. And I did. Tolls to 250. And we've got him. There you go, Manny Margot. You're just talking about him. That's a rookie, Manny Margot. That's back when he was in San Diego. That'll be for Joel and the Padres. He was a pretty big prospect. I thought he was going to be like a 30-30 guy. Yeah, exactly. I mean, he's still playing well for the Rays, but... Yeah, I just got like just Yeah, yeah. We got Goldschmidt again to 250 for the Diamondbacks. So what do you think, Evan? How long does how much longer does this lockout go? I'm gonna say another month. We're gonna miss a month again. Wow, you think a month? I think they're tired of talking right now. I think they're gonna take a little break. And there's Jose Altuve, autograph for Brian and the Astros. Man, so you think entire March just slips by? Yeah. Jeez. I don't I don't want to believe you, but no, I, no, I, I, don't I think you I think I think you might be right though. I think they'll realize, uh oh, it's April, it's time to get going. What a mess. What do we got here? Each one's a box of that dollar. 
Oh, this is the Ben Baller. Yeah. Chrome, nice. Three boxes of Ben Baller right here, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. Here's Mookie Betts. Austin Meadows to 99. That's for the Rays. That'll go to Joel and the Rays. And we got a Jake Cronenworth, 24 out of 50. The Crone Zone. Going to Joel and the Padres. Got a Joey Bart for the Giants. Michael P saying no. No. I yeah, know. one more March meeting. I hope so. I hope they get together this week. But I think the player reps flew back to New York. I think the owners left and everything. So. Yeah, there's Dalton Varsho to 75 for the Diamondbacks. You can only negotiate so much before it just gets right. ridiculous. There's Corey Kluber to 25, orange for the Rangers. That's going to go to Martin. Carlos Correa, blue to 75 for the Astros. This is pretty cool. You can see the, the Ben Baller, the double B logo kind of hanging off the top's chrome logo. There's a Joey Gallo die cut to 99. Let's actually sleeve this to protect it. Nah, Jazzy J, you didn't tell me nothing. <laughs> He's like, he, he has an uncle down there who's in the know, and he was like, oh, oh the season's gonna be canceled, and blah, blah, blah. <laughs> He's like, sure. I mean, anyone can tell me that, right? <laughs> You're funny, Jazzy Jay. You're funny. Is it you funny. Get stuff from Rex? Is, is it from Rex? <laughs> maybe. maybe. <laughs> I don't know if the whole season's at risk, though. Not yet. Really. They're, they're going to they're gonna realize they like making money. Look, they played 50 games two years ago. They're, we're far away from the yeah. whole Yeah, this is a pretty efficient break. There's an auto. There's Casey Mize, nice rookie auto for the Tigers. David. Right, Chazzy J has connections, sure. I've been doing this for seven, eight years, man. There's four out of ten Tigers. If I if I had if I had a nickel for every time someone was in the know or had connections or whatever, I'd have thousands of dollars. <laughs> Oh yeah, my brother's in the, oh yeah, he's in, I know agents, I know, it's like, yeah, sure. You may, just because you're being the they're telling you the truth. Yeah, <laughs> people who have connections generally don't, <laughs> generally don't say they have connections, yeah. There's the 99, Nick Madrigal. Nah, I'm not wrong, Jazzy J, anyone could have guessed that. And yeah, David, for uh, for bigger breaks like this, sometimes I'll, I'll recruit the assistance of uh, one of our colleagues here to do that. That's a 99, Dylan Carlson. Yeah, out of 10, he's a former number one overall pick too. Mike Trout Green, 27 out of 99. That's his jersey number. Right, but Jay, come on, man. It's not like it's not like them not coming to an agreement was a hot take. You know, it's not like you were saying something like out of the ordinary. Out of fifty. I said that, that it looked like the progress was good, the way they were going deep into the night and talking. Then it changed. I wasn't making any guarantees. And it's not like you made a hot take <laughs> saying that they weren't gonna get, a, get it done. So it's not like you said anything special. I think 50% of people probably thought it was gonna get done. I think the other half probably didn't think it was gonna get done. All right, to 25, there's Zach Granke. Callie's asking, are the Raiders getting Devontae Adams? I don't know. 
I would like them to. There's Kettle Marte, 75. It'd be awesome if they if they did. I don't know if that's what they need. They could they could use someone to replace a Henry Ruggs, the big big play receiver. Yeah, yeah. But I mean like I don't know if they, they have the money for that though. Guys up, but Get some or some right. Yeah, there's some other non-sexy positions yeah, to yeah. kind of fill. They do need some offensive line help. Exactly. There's Kyle Lewis to 99. And there's Andrew Benintendi to 75. A lot of parallels in this. This is pretty cool. Aaron Judge. Eugenio Suarez, 50 out of 50. All right. What do we got here? Some Donruss Optic. 2016. Going back in time. Trey Turner rated rookie card. Kind of interesting to see like who turned out great. Right. Maybe not Greg Bird, but then there's Aaron Nola and then there's Trey Turner. Hector Oliveira to 10. The San Diego Chicken, which we won't randomize. That's actually not for the Padres, ladies and gentlemen, believe it or not. He's, he's his own man, the Padres' own employee. That's to 149, Andrew McCutcheon. That redemption there may be... Uh, may be expired, it probably is expired by this point, but we'll still send it to whatever team it goes to. There's Travis Jankowski, 15 out of 125. Rated rookie. San Diego, Joel. Sure is, Brad, if you look at the schedule, it'll say that that's what we're doing. It's a monster. It's Byung-Ho Park. Wins? Does he sound like a twin? <laughs> uh, I think back in 2016, he was indeed a twin. Just for the just for that season, I thought he played for a couple more seasons after that. But this is expired. Uh, Chris Walker in Minnesota, but we'll still send it to you anyway. Sometimes Panini will will uh, maybe. Actually, send you the card if they have them. If, it, if they have them around, or sometimes they'll uh, they'll give you like points in return or something like that. Pirates, you were thinking of of Jung -ho, another park, I think. Jung Ho Park, I think, it was the Pirates' third baseman. Got into a little trouble, Brad. You have, did you only get one spot? I see you with the Braves, Brad Newman, Atlanta Braves. I don't think we had any big Braves yet pop out of here. Maybe some numbered cards, but not too much after that. There is Jorge Lopez. And out of 50, Buster Posey. Jorge Lopez is uh, for the Brew Crew. That's going to go to Michael L. All right, Carl Edwards Jr. to 10. And he's supposed to be, or was supposed to be, a big pitching prospect for the Cubs. I don't know what he's doing now, though. Don. He's still pigeon. With the uh, with the Cubs, are you still a pigeon? He's still pigeon, yeah. But just not the top of the rotation guy we thought he was uh, going to be. Being a good reliever. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Here's it. Aegon to twenty five. I think Adrian Gonzalez officially retired. Retired. He did. 
think he was in a he was like owning and playing on a Mexican team. Yeah, Mexico League team. And he finally hung it up. Tom Murphy rated rookie autograph for the Rockies. Tim with the Rockies. John Lamb, 24 out of 99. Rated rookie autograph for the Reds. That's going to be for Kevin. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Michael. I think we're, how many boxes in do you think we are? Eight, maybe? Oh, uh, yeah, about. About eight, eight, eight boxes in. Ooh, and a big Hurt autograph. Significant signatures. Trust me, she'll like it too, Chris Parent. <laughs> she'll like it too. <laughs> this break sponsored by... Eugenics. By eugenics, exactly. Get your free testosterone higher. Be careful with the little ones. Like oh, yeah, the, the minis slip out of here. So that San Diego chicken card, will all will uh, what we're going to do is we're going to randomize to the name on top the all the non-baseball cards. So there was, in the Ben Baller, there was those artist cards. There's this uh, mascot card right here, and I'm sure there's some non-baseball cards in here too. So those will be uh, randomized to one person as one lot. Like Sarah Spain. And these world leaders cards. Leo Kelly. Why is he in the social media story? He's six years old. He's six? Leo asked his parents if he could start an Instagram page to post a review, calling himself the Shirley Temple King. He's reviewing Shirley drinks? <laughs> wow. He began producing funny, witty, and brutally honest video reviews of non-alcoholic beverages. Wow. A viral tweet in 2019 made Kelly an overnight star, jetting the number of followers from 300 to 30,000 in a single day. Jeez. Here's the world largest cruise ship, the Royal Caribbean Symphony of the Sea. And there's Candelario, it's 25. Evan, are you a cruise guy? I am not. You're not a cruise guy. I, I get super boat sick. Oh, you get boat? I know that you okay. don't uh, supposedly do that on a cruise, but I'm I don't not think you do, it. yeah. I am not taking the risk. But you're a little seasick, you're not gonna take the yeah, risk. Yeah, dude, All I right. got bad for the guy, so. Uh, I just don't like being contained. Contained like that in a, I don't know. Couldn't agree more. And you know what though? Every person who got on a cruise to come back and told me that it was fantastic. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Although people say that if you're gonna go to, if you're gonna vacation in Alaska, a cruise is good because you yes. actually see like the coastline. Yeah, that's what I hear. Um. As opposed to if you just go there and you're like, oh, this is just like flat and ice. Yeah, it's just yeah. <laughs> I uh, you know what? Maybe when I'm older. There you go. A little, you know, a little less adventurous. Want to just right, 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 right. Not a bad idea. Paul Tate, what's up? With expired redemption, send them a link to the video to prove you got it. All right. True. There is a casino on a cruise. Hey, can you tell Thomas that? It's true. You can ask Vanessa for help. Thomas, if you want to ask Vanessa for help, you can. There's you Mount have, Everest. If you want to ask Vanessa for help. World's largest. World's largest mountain. I guess world's <laughs> largest mountain on on land. Oh, and a Miguel Sano four out of five mini. I think this is our first train whistle of the break. Nice Minnesota Twins. Chris Walker with the Twins. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. So I always check the check the backs of those because some of these minis can be numbered. You a Star Wars guy, Evan? I am. Did you, did you see the new Star Wars hotel or whatever that Disney's trying no, to? No, is it sick? It looks pretty cool, but uh, it's like fifty three hundred dollars a night. It's over five thousand bucks a night. Cool. How big is it? Like for like two two twins or two queens. <laughs> 
maybe a, maybe one or one big king. Um, and the and the inside and it's just inside just looks like like it, no, it's like like a bunker. Like, but it's all it's all trimmed out in like all the Star Wars like transports. You know what I mean? So it looks cool, but it's nothing like. Yeah, I thought it was crazy too. Here's your world's largest plane, the Antonov AN-225 Mira. Back in 1988. It remains the longest and heaviest plane ever. So so all of these non-sports cars right there, that'll be an example, will be part of will be grouped together as one lot. What do we got here? Some select. Select two hobby boxes. All right. Good luck. It's an Alec Baum Silver. There's Evan White to 199. Jersey and autograph. Rookie jersey and auto for Brian and the Mariners. Who, Evan White? Yeah, every time I want to. A little Evan on Evan Mojo? Evan and Mojo? Every time. And once again, that's for the M's. Brian with the Mariners. And of course, we'll do an autograph and relic recap at the end of this video. What do they do with this guy? Oh, you, you don't think MLB is going to suspend him, though, don't you think? No, I mean, on what terms? I mean, they've, they, they've suspended guys for... For lessons. Yeah. That's for sure. There's Tanner Hawk, 116 to 199. I'd love to see Jersey and autograph for Matt and the Red Sox. Is that? I'd love to see him get suspended. Yeah, I'm I think he's a I mean, bad guy. Yeah. When you're... Best, you know, your second pitcher in college is Garrett Cole, and you guys can't even get along. Right. Right. Two of the top three picks. Andres, they all went to UCLA, right? Yeah. And Andres Jimenez. Picked one and three. Cleveland, that'll be for Kevin. Cleveland, this is for you. It's Walker Bueller, 149. I mean, Walker Bueller, Cy Young, maybe Cy in the next yeah, two or three years? I think he's kind of in that sort of zone where he can have that sort of signature season. Yep, it's coming. Adonis Medina for the Phillies. That goes to Harry and the Fighting Phils. Eighteen out of ninety-nine. JT Real Muto. Antonio saying they blew up that world's largest plane in the Ukraine. They did. They did. Yep. That plane that we That's were just talking the about? Plane that you just hit. Oh, I thought Antonio was joking. Nope. That was one of the first casualties. Wow. So I guess no. A pretty, pretty big target. <laughs> formerly the world's largest yeah, plane then. Alright, next select. Tyler Stevenson 142 to 250. Piece of the jersey for Cincinnati. That's for Kevin. Spencer Howard, 180, 193 out of 199. Jersey and autograph for the fight in Phils. Harry with the Phillies. His Phillies. He's a Phillies guy. He got randomized his own team. Juan Soto to 199. I got William Contreras for the Braves. Jersey and autograph for Brad and the World Champs. It's Wilson's brother. 106 out of 199. Younger brother? Yes. Must be younger brother. Yeah. He's a rookie in this room. Yeah. Yeah. Kiebert Ruiz. Piece of his jersey. Still Dodgers edition here. That's going to go to Zach. Brady Singer to 149. 
Tanner Hawk, Jake Diegman, and a tie-dye, Xander Bogarts. Nice, 13 out of 20. I like these tie-dyes, yeah. Matt Lieber with Boston. Mail's here. Bing bong. I love hitting that button. <laughs> I'll hit it. Tom's is coming to you gotta hit it. Go, 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 go. Wait for it. Mail's here. <laughs> Alright, what do we got here? Rookies and star? Oh no, these are so, chronicles. So these three are 2020 and then this is over here 2020. So these three 2020 Chronicles, yep. and these two are 21 Chronicles. Yep. Oh, we're getting to the nicer stuff here, so. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're down we're, to the end. We're getting to the, the is that is it? Empty. Whoa! Nice, thanks, Evan. Of course. Lifesaver. Uh, <laughs> twice? <laughs> yeah. we, got, we got hitting it Thomas, twice? Thomas, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I want to hit that bell. He's like, man, it's my job, too. I want that bell. <laughs> All right, we got a Jesus Lazardo, big three-color oh. patch, and on-card autograph. He's, he's supposed to be good, right? He is. He is. 10 out of 10. Nice low number for the Oakland A's, Chris Walker. He got traded last, uh, traded deadline. Wait, where did he go? This Enio de los Santos autograph for Harry and the Phillies. Marlins. He went to the Marlins. Yeah. Now, the Marlins have a low key, kind of have a really good starting pitching staff. Yeah. Six is a beast. They got Rogers, Trevor, Ro yeah, Trevor Rogers. They got a couple other guys too that are, that are there that. Can you believe Derek Jeter's out? Yeah, that was crazy. That, I did not expect to see that. I didn't either. I have a feeling we got a business venture where you couldn't do both. There's uh, Sean Reed Foley's signatures for Toronto. I think he talked to the GM and the GM was like, we're not spending money on free agents. And he's like, I'm, I'm bouncing, yeah. He just said, no, no wasting money. Yeah, it's like, why would I waste here with like... <laughs> There's Kevin Benedict with the Blue Jays. And maybe he did have something else. And he's yeah. like, all right, you know what? If you're not going to do this, like, if you're not gonna have fun. then I'll go do this thing. <laughs> There's Yachty. Cardinals. That's going to be Michael. Michael L. with that one. A Volt. Last year. Should be his, I mean, season half, it should be his last year. <laughs> you want me to take triple threat out of the rabbit? Yeah, go for it. Might as well. Might as well. We're on a roll. <laughs> Pablo Reyes, autograph, out of twenty-five for Pittsburgh. That's gonna go to it's gonna go to Brian P. Lorenzo Kane, one out of twenty-five. And we got Dylan Cease, Origins Auto. Right on the card, nine out of twenty-five for the South Siders. Chris with the White Sox. Like the White Sox are also on the cusp of maybe they kind of had a disappointing playoff last year, they, but, yeah, but they're on the cusp. They're they're, they're on the very, cusp, very yeah. I mean, you can almost argue that those youngsters can get even better. Yes. <laughs> it's just yeah. crazy to think about. Like how old is Luis Robert? He can't be that old. No, he can't be. Twenty maybe. Maybe. He's a MVP candidate. Yeah, absolutely. I like Eloy too. Mm -hmm. Jose was an MVP. 
You got a solid starting rotation, yeah. good bullpen. Speaking of Jose Abreu, there he is, piece of his jersey. <laughs> That's the second time today. Chris Parent, yeah, spoke him into existence. And there's Brendan McKay, 26 out of 99. I think he came up as a two-way player, Brendan McKay. Let's see if the Rays keep him as a two-way player. Yeah, absolutely. There's Aristides Aquino, nice. 45 out of 60 for the Slugger rookie auto. Timeless Treasures design. Kevin with the Reds. And a plate. A plate and an autograph. Who are you? That's Cesar Hernandez. For the tribe, Kevin with Cleveland. This is for you. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And a Logan Webb Origins rookie auto for my rivals of the Giants, Dom, with the Giants. Darling Marte, piece of his jersey in that Spectra design. For Matt and Arizona. There's Eloy Jimenez to 199. And we got an out of 50 Gavin Lux. Buster Posey. Oh man, is this it? That is wow. it, my friend. Evan, man, we cranked. I appreciate it, man. Lifesaver. So Lifesaver. These, these are cracked open, the seals are broken, so you okay, can do so a I can just pop those open. These and those. You're awesome. Thanks, right, Evan. Anytime. Everyone say thanks to Evan. Anytime. Four out of ten, Todd Frazier. He helped cut down the time of this rig significantly. Alright, so that was twenty twenty, and these two boxes are twenty twenty one. Out of 25, Aaron Judge. Right. And we got a nice Jose Ramirez, Elite Auto. Cleveland, this is for you. Awesome, thank you, Evan. We got a Geraldo Perdomo gold standard design. Five out of five. That's a train whistle from Matt Lieber. Matt, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! This is Taylor Trammell, autograph. That's for Seattle. That's um, Brian. Brian B. with the M's. We got a Jonathan Daza. Rockies autograph for Tim. Ozzy Alves, piece of his jersey, going to Brad and the Braves.
We've got an overdrive keeper Ruiz to 99. Christian Pache. Silver ink autograph on Origins. Bjorn, are you doing the Immaculate NBA break tonight? Yes. If it sells out, I'll do it. There's no reason why I wouldn't. If you look at the schedule, we have plenty of time. Nice Christian Pache, Brad, and the Braves. Playbook autograph, Michael King for the Yankees. That's for Michael, uh, Michael P with the Michael K. Willie Castro for Detroit. Prestige autograph for David. Last spot, Mojo. Tigers. Corey Seeger, piece of his jersey, 99. Still Dodgers edition here, Zach, with the Dodgers. Here. Oh, this looks like, looks like this is more Chronicles here. And we'll get into some trip threads. Nice, Logan. I like that sentiment. There's Adonis Medina, Origin Silver Ink autograph for Philadelphia. Logan saying baseball lockout ends next week. And Bitcoin to 50,000 a coin. I like that. That's that's a bullish sentiment. I hope that happens. There's Ed Howard, playbook autograph for the Cubbies, done with Chicago. Xander Bogarts, two color, dual relic for Boston. Got a Mike Trout, a Luis Robert, red, to uh, 199. Out of 299, Logan Gilbert. And a Cabrian Hayes, gold standard autograph, nice. Rookie auto for Brian Pinch and the Pirates. Nice. I'm seeing some nice, nice hits popping here, ladies and gentlemen. So far, so good. Got some train whistles. Seeing some nice hits. And we haven't even gotten to the the higher higher end stuff and and the uh, the memorabilia too. There's Luis Camposano. Silver ink auto for the Padres. That'll be for Joel. And Tony Gonsolin. That is for the Dodgers. That's going to be for Zach. Let's reload on some top loaders here. Sam Sherry saying, it's a dream, Logan. Wake up. Sam is Logan a bull. Sam a bear. Joe, you need anything? No, I'm good, sir. All right. I'll see you... When am I see you next? Today's Wednesday. Friday? Or Not Monday? here Friday. Next week. Monday. I'll see you Monday. All right. Have a good one, man. Have a good weekend. You too. All right, we got Tristan McKenzie to 100. 
to attack those acetate cards here. We've got a Corey Seager, another piece of his jersey for the Dodgers. That's going to go to Zach. Haven Smith, 25. And that uh, Hirokazu is to 75. And nice, Pudge, Ivan Rodriguez autograph, 5 out of 25. It's pretty nice. For the Texas Rangers, that's going to be for Martin and the Rangers. Got a Kiebert Ruiz to 199 for uh, the Dodgers. All right, so there's the Chronicles. Uh, now let's start working on some triple threads. All right. We got a Tyler Stevenson triple relic and autograph, 62 out of 99, Cincinnati Reds. It's going to be for Kevin. We got a single jumbo relic, Miguel Andujar. 11 out of 36 for the Yankees. This is going to be for Michael. Got a Buster Posey to 199. Will Thrill to 299, both for the Giants. We got a Rafael Devers breakout triple rug. These are usually split up into three. 29 out of 36. Well, Jojo. All right, like Evan. Thank you so much. No Appreciate it. Have a great one. Can you actually get me one more monster box, please? Absolutely. Thanks. Sure. So for the Red Sox, that's going to be for Matt Lieber in Boston. We got a Josh Bell, 68 out of 99, jersey and autograph for the Nats. David, for the Nationals. A little wrinkly on the penny sleeve there, but secure. And then we got Garrett Cole to 299 and Jackie Robinson to 75. Thanks, Evan. All right, another triple threads box. We got, wow, nice. Monthly honors Eddie Murray. Piece of his lumber, his autograph, eight out of 27. Orioles, Jeff Dorlach. Nice. Since the AL Player of the Month award was instituted in 1975, Eddie's four prizes are twice as many as any other Orioles player. Pretty good. Single Jumbo Relic. That's Manny Machado. It's almost two colors right there. That's for the Padres. That's going to go to Joel. Mount Castle to 125. Fernando Tatis Jr. to 199. Got a Jose Altuve. Batting champ. 23 out of 27. For the Astros, Brian, the Triple Relic. We've got a Willie Castro jersey and auto, 16 out of 50. Detroit, David, with his last spot mojo team. And then Lou Gehrig to 125, Cody Bellinger to 150. All right, let's do some clearly authentic Good luck. First one out of the gate is Doc Gooden. What up, Doc? 84 out of 99. Mets. Michael P. with the Metropolitans. Ray, what's going on? Your prod bets are killing you. You're sweating a Randall, Embiid, Harden, all 25 plus points. I still have a full quarter left.
What what how many what what points are they at, Adam? We got a Brand Lau, three out of twenty five. Rookie autograph for the Rays, Joel. With Tampa Bay. And a Pete Alonzo rookie auto. 10 out of 10, Michael. Nice. All right, how about some Sapphire? Harden's 21. Oh, he'll get 25. And Bede's at 23. He'll get 25. Randall will get 25. I believe. There's Shaylin Polanco to 50. That's for the Pirates. That's going to go to. It's going to go to Brian. And we got a Kai Bush, four out of 15. Nice little number for the Angels. Reed. There's Andrew Painter to 20 for Philadelphia, for Harry. And we got a Jordan Viars, Viars, 56 out of 99 for the Phillies. Nice, love the Sapphire stuff, it's really cool. All right, what about some Bowman Chrome X? We got a Dylan Carlson, nice. Six out of 31. The X Fractors are really cool. Dylan Carlson, rookie card. That is for Michael and the Cardinals. Next up is Luis Medina, 28 out of 31 for the Brew Crew. These cards look really sharp. Uh, other Michael, Michael Losi with that one. Brewers. And we got a Dalton Varsho, 14 out of 31. Do the Braves have any prospects? I'm sure they do. Braves usually draft pretty well. On the lower part of the draft, but they still draft pretty well. All right, uh, let's do the three baseballs first. So we're down to our last uh, one, two, three, four, five boxes. We made it, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so remember, as I mentioned at the beginning of the break, um, unless there's literally like a the team logo stamped on there, this is going to go to the the, uh, the team they played for the longest if they're retired or the team they're currently on if they're active. All right, do they give me the name of the player? Yes, they do. This is the... This is the Fanata... Does it say the name? No. Okay, just want to make sure it didn't say the name. All right, can anyone guess this autograph? So there is the Fanatic stickers and all the MLB logos. Oh, this is easy. Um, yeah, Goose Gossage, of course, um, spent uh, 
22 years in the league, seven years the most with the New York Yankees. Oh, that says Goose Goss is right there, of course. And that will go to Michael P. And the Yankees. Next up. Ooh, this is pretty cool. What's, what do we got here? All right, there's the autograph. But there's some text on the other side that's pretty cool. Any guesses on that autograph? The PSA DNA sticker back here. And on here, it's Gregory Polanco. I like that text. El Coffee, Pittsburgh Pirates, MLB debut. Limited edition 12 of 25. That's pretty cool. Gregory Polanco, of course, uh, has played all eight of his years in Pittsburgh. I don't know how they wrap these so well. Gregory Polanco right there. And that'll be for Brian and the Pirates. All right, and next player. Fanatics sticker, and will be hologram sticker, and I think it goes this way. Any guesses on that? H2O Molecule. No, it's Greg Bird. Um, I guess he's a free agent, so he's not active. Played for the longest uh, with the Yankees. His four seasons with the New York Yankees. Right, you see Greg Bird right there as well. Another one for Michael P. and the Yankees. Two mini helmets from Hit Parade. And these will have the team logos on it. So that should be pretty easy. So that means... Oh, you met Greg Bird? Nice guy. All right, now we can play two quick rounds of Who Am I? America's Favorite Game. Who am I? I'm a third baseman, bats left, throws right, one-time All-Star, a World Series champion, and a Silver Slugger Award winner. Played for five seasons in, uh, in Major League Baseball. Uh, last season was when I got my Silver Slugger, finished 11th in MVP voting, and was uh, my first All-Star. Last season hit 279, 38 home runs, 113 RBIs, a handful of stolen bases, 37 doubles, and a triple. Oh, 
OPS 890. It's pretty good. Who am I? All right, no guesses. Not Brandon Lau. Bryce Harper's not a third baseman. Oh, this is a cool looking helmet. It's Raphael Devers. In this cool sort of mirror looking helmet right here. You can see my camera right there in the reflection. You can see Raphael Devers in the little sticker right there. Autograph right on the bill. And you can see Devers on the sticker right in there as well. So that's for uh, Matt Lieber and the Boston Red Sox. All right, and the 37th box of the break. Yeah, Chrome Dome. 37th box of the break. Let's see who this is going to be. All right. This is a retired player. Played for, played for a few teams. Four teams his entire career. And let's see. He's a Hall of Famer, a one-time MVP, a 14-time All-Star, a five-time World Series winner, two-time Silver Slugger and a two-time World Series MVP. Who am I? Finished with a career, uh, 262 batting average, 563 home runs, seven, over 1,700 RBIs, a couple hundred stolen bases too. Ended up with 463 doubles, almost 50 triples in my career. It's pretty good, pretty clutch as well. And I played for Baltimore one year, which I don't associate him with Baltimore at all. Hit 277, 27 home runs, 91 RBIs with, uh, with Baltimore. Now, Chipper Jones has not won five World Series or two World Series MVPs. Uh, Jim Murray's got it. That's right. The straw that stirs the drink. Reggie Jackson. He played for the Orioles in 1976. What 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 was the what was the deal there? I, I'll, I'll have to look that up later. But it's Yankees edition of Reggie Jackson. That's really nice. And uh, it's Michael with the Yankees. Michael Pete. There you go. Wow, what a break. Um, I'm surprised we don't have any more randomizers aside from those non-baseball cards. So let's do that randomizer, and then I'll do a recap. All right, so these represent the uh, those non-baseball uh, cards um, from, uh, from, I think Ben Baller had those artist cards, and then, of course, the Ginter Chrome, and then the, that San Diego Chicken. So let's flip back to the list here. Let's gather everybody's names top to bottom. New dice, new list, name on, name on top. We'll get those cards. After a three and a four, seven times. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, Reed. There you go, Reed. Uh, you'll get those non-baseball cards going your way. Michael, Brad, you're welcome. Brad, I wish there was more for you, but like especially some Acunas, but I appreciate you getting in. Thank you. All right. So there are your cards from Bowman Chrome X. There's the Kai Bush from Sapphire. Clearly authentic, had some nice stuff. There's that Eddie Murray autograph, which is really cool. And of course, give us a little extra. It's a pretty big mixer here. <laughs> 37 boxes so of this baseball mixer. So make sure uh, you give our shipping team a, a little patience. If you click the break schedule that's pinned in the chat and dropped in the chat frequently, there's actually a shipping tab that'll kind of give you some, uh, kind of give you some uh, updates on what the status is of the breaks from from tonight. Yeah, the uh, what yeah, what what do you think is the best hit of the break? I mean, we had some nice old school names in here, but the Alonzo rookie out of 10 was pretty nice. I mean, there was a Cabrian Hayes auto in there somewhere too. So that was pretty nice. I mean, we got an out of 5 Sano, Frank Thomas, You know that Mike Trout from Ben Baller, jersey numbered? What about rookie Casey Mize to 10? That's pretty good too. Oh, I don't know where that Cabrian, there's a Cabrian Hayes in there as well. That was also a nice hit. And there you go, that's the recap for the 37 box. Ba uh, bring back baseball mixer, hopefully it'll come back soon. Big thanks to my colleague Evan who was uh, who was helping rip packs earlier. I think we saved, we probably saved 30 or 40 minutes on this break because of that. So big thanks to him. And thanks everyone for watching. Thanks everyone for joining. I'm Joe for Jaspi's Case, breaks.com. Bring back baseball. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.